हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू आवर चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल एंड हिट द बेल आइकन एंड बी द फर्स्ट टू वॉच द लेटेस्ट अपलोड्स थैंक यू सिक्स पॉइंट बंकर हिल एवेन्यू यू नो वेयर दैट इज बिहाइंड बंकर हिल कपल ब्लॉक्स नॉर्थ ऑफ सेंट्रल स्टेशन सो व्हाट डू वी टेल द वाइफ वी प्ले इट बाय द बुक नो स्टिफ येट सो लेट्स सी हाउ इट प्लेस आउट a car that gone wrong big black dress somewhere lonely and give him a tap but why leave the car well, obviously someone got a little heavy hand it's the wrong way around how so genius where is adrian if you've gone to all the trouble to steal the car and it goes wrong you leave the body behind not the car you got something that folks does not up guy on the crossing yesterday? No, what happened? Over on Lincoln Avenue. This guy's driving along and his oil light comes on. He stops the car and gets out. <laughs> he pops the hood and he's on a rail crossing. Oh, you got it. He's got his head under there checking the oil and the Southern Pacific freight slams into his car doing 90 miles an hour. The car came to a rest more than a mile down the track. <laughs> what a pointless waste of life. You'll get plenty of blood and guts and mindless stupidity working traffic folks. And who needs a second amendment when we'll give a goddamn fool the license to get behind the wheel of an automobile? If it's a kidnapping, why leave the victim's ID? If it's a murder, why leave the car? The evidence doesn't add up. Free lesson, folks. Evidence will only get you so far. You ask me, the whole thing feels hinky as hell. What I wouldn't give to have your powers of intuition, Castle. Don't worry, kid. Keep watching the master and you'll get there one day. You're a goddamn menace. Let's go introduce ourselves. You talk to her, Phelps. I'm no good at this shoulder to cry on stuff. Just a minute. LAPD, Mrs. Black. May we come in? We have some bad news and we'd rather discuss this in private. I'm Margaret Black. Oh, we can discuss this in the living room. Please come in.
Your husband drives a blue Lincoln, Mrs. Black? That's correct. The car has been found abandoned, and I'm afraid there are signs of foul play. I knew something was wrong when he didn't come home. We believe your husband may be injured. We found a pipe on the scene with blood on it. Oh, no! My poor Adrian! Does the name Instaheat mean anything to you, ma'am? Yes, it does. We've just had a new water heater installed. Whereabouts, Mrs. Black? Just outside the kitchen window, at the side of the house. I'd like you to try and stay calm and remember everything that you can about last night. My partner and I are going to take a look around. When you're ready, we're going to have some more questions for you. Is that okay? Of course, officer. Anything to help secure my husband's safety. Well, let's check the place out. Come on. Not sure this means much. This doesn't pertain to the case. Have a good look around. There's got to be something in here to go on. Cavanaugh's. So who brought this home? Doubt it. Maybe if no. Maybe Adrian was a patron. R and I should have an address. Grab the phone. R and I could run down an address for Kavanaugh's in no time. Operator, give me R and I. Putting you through now. Phelps, one two four seven. How could I help, Detective? I need an address on a Kavanaugh's bar. Certainly, Detective. One moment. Kavanaugh's bar. Corner of Aliso and Hewitt, south side of Union Station. Thanks for your help. We found a receipt in the trunk of your husband's car for a live pig. 
This receipt was made out to an F. Morgan. A pig? Adrian runs a tool business. That would be Frank Morgan. God knows what he's up to. What makes you say that about Morgan, ma'am? He's the foreman at my husband's plant. A very shady character. I told Adrian he needs to keep his distance from the staff. They're always out drinking together. Your husband frequents Kavanaugh's bar? How did you know that? Adrian practically lives there after work. So Adrian spends a lot of time there? Up until recently, he's been away in Seattle a lot on business. Did your husband tell you where he was going last night? All he said was he was going to meet Frank for a drink. So you didn't arrange to meet him out at the rail yards? I've never been near a rail yard in my life. No, you don't. What's a special with looking for someone? This is a tasty burger. You know Frank Morgan? Sure. Frank's a regular. He's a loner in the back. Where's that goddamn waitress? J.W. Robinson are having a sale. Frank Morgan? Don't you know? Who's asking? Cole Phelps, LAPD. I understand you're a friend of Adrian Black. Yeah, I know him. Are you aware that he's missing? No, I hadn't heard that. Tough break. We found Black's car abandoned in a freight depot, covered in blood. You know anything about that, Morgan? 
Hell no. I, I, I'm sorry to hear that. I like Adrian. He, he's a good boss. Please, don't tell me you actually believe this jerk-off, Phelps. I think you were in on it, Morgan. You drove down there, and you let Black have it. Ooh, I'm a bad boy. That the best you got? When did you last see Adrian? Hell, I don't know. Uh, I had plenty to drink last night. Things are a little sketchy. Come on, Morgan. It was only last night. You must remember something. Look, we might have had a drink. We have a drink most nights after work. This doesn't add up, Morgan. Your excuses don't help. Let's see how you enjoy the LAPD taking an interest in your life. You want my opinion? We tell Morgan. I say he's lying, and whatever hole he's got Adrian stashed in, he's got to go back there sometime. Sure left his drink in a hurry. Bet he wishes he'd rehearsed that story better now. Where are you taking us, Mr. Morgan?
Well, let's check the place out. Come on. Day one of the big time, and you're already tailing drunks home from bars. You having fun yet? I told you it was nonstop glamour work and traffic, didn't I? I'm just trying to learn. Oh, come on, Phelps. Save the creepy teacher's pet stuff for Leary. Won't work on it. Apartment two. All right, let's pay our friend a visit, see if he's missed us yet. Who the hell is that? Will you relax? Jesus, Adrian, I told you, we're in the clear. I'll get it. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. It's over, Morgan. Mr. Black, LAPD, give yourself up now. I knew it. Phelps, go I after him. I'll try and head him off in the car. Remember, the gun is the last resort. There's no point running, Adrian. Mr. Black, get back here right now! It's Stop over, there, Adrian. Adrian! Why did you need to get out of L.A. so fast, Adrian? Why the melodrama? I've met somebody in Seattle. She means everything to me. We were going to start a new life together. Looks like she'll have to wait for you. Adrian Black, you're under arrest for conspiracy and fraud. We'll see what the DA has to say about wasting police resources on a wild goose chase like this. You're going to the big house, Adrian. And when your wife finds out, you're going to lose her too. I hope this broad was worth it. That turned out to be quite some case, huh? Adrian, what an idiot. You got an arrest and a clearance in your first case, and in fine style, too. Well done, detective. Efficient investigation technique, good public presence. You keep that up and you learn from Bukowski here, you could go a long way in this department. 